Ilke, congratulations on signing. How does it feel to be a City player? Thank you, thank you very much. I'm, I'm, I'm really happy now to be, as I said, to be a part of the Manchester City family. And I hope you will enjoy, you will enjoy the type of, uh, of football I play. And um, we, will, we, will, uh, we will earn a, a lot together and uh, have a very good time. Backbeat, the word is on the street. The Bruyne. Oh, what a... The Dark. First start in the Premier League. And his first Premier League goal. It's a goal. Ilkay Gundogan. Sterling. Gundogan. Ilkay oh, Gundogan. Oh, the memories! The goal. Don't forget after notes like this. Well, Gundogan now able to wriggle. Oh, what a goal! Gundogan, he sat down Sanchez and he scored again. The guy can do no wrong. This weekend, it did 2 Sterling, the goal. Gundogan raises this famous old trophy high. Manchester City, the European champions. Well, it's official. Ilkay Gundogan has left Manchester City and has joined Barcelona on a free transfer following the end of his contract. Uh, a little bit of a reel there of uh, Ilkay Gundogan's career at Manchester City. It was Pep Guardiola's first ever signing. People will remember that he was actually signed injured. Pep wanted him that much. And uh, I think I think it's fair to say when he first joined, there was a little bit of question marks about him. I wasn't too sure exactly what he did, but he quickly found his way in this side, both in a defensive duty going forward, uh, and obviously towards the end of his career at City this season as as a captain as well. The first ever captain of Manchester City to lift the Champions League. Quite a few captains have tried. He was the only one that did it. Also did the treble. Also beat Manchester United. Um, in the first ever Manchester Derby FA Cup final, scoring a goal within 12 seconds. I think he should be remembered as one of Manchester City's greatest ever players because the things that he's done, uh, it, it's 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 stunning. It is absolutely what he's done in the last two years, especially, is absolutely incredible. He is a fantastic footballer. I don't think he gets the respect in this country that he deserves. However, I will I will say. That in my view, in the last couple of months, I do sense that a lot of non-Manchester City fans have now actually started to respect him more than they probably did a year ago. Uh, and that's fair play to, 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 to those fans who are respecting the quality that Ilkay Gundogan has. I think he's probably the best German that's ever played in the Premier League. And it's a sad day. It is a very, very sad day. I think City needs to have a look at what, what they did with the contract situation because... There are question marks about whether or not if City offered Gundogan a two-year contract six or seven months ago, would we be in this position now or would we? Um, would he have signed a contract? Maybe City offered him that two-year contract a little bit too late. That's probably something that maybe some people don't want to talk about right now. That's that's fair, but it probably is something to look at. But, <clears throat> but yeah, guys, it's a sad day. It's a very sad day. Just a quick reaction video to it. And uh, yeah, best of luck to the guy in Barcelona. It's not a bad place to play out your career uh, in living in Barcelona, obviously, with his family, his, his newborn kid as well. So massive respect to Ilkay Gundogan. Thank you if you're watching this. Thank you very much for everything that you've done for this football club. Pep Guardiola's first ever signing. I think that tells you everything you need to know about what Pep thinks about the player. And uh, yeah, what a guy. The first ever uh, captain to lift the Champions League. Thank you very much, Wilkai Gundogan. Uh, we will be live later on talking about some transfer news, but leave your comments in the comment section below. How important do you think Wilkai Gundogan was to Manchester City throughout Pep Guardiola's reign at the, uh, at the manager of this football club? Give us your top three moments, Wilkai Gundogan. And uh, guys, I'll see you in the next one. See you later.